It's the last episode in the series. Thank you so much for joining me. Let's go ahead and tie this thing up. Hopefully you had a great holiday last week and you relaxed and you spent some family time and now you're back at it and you're like, okay, Katrina, I am ready to learn all the key components about finding the balance in this earning it mindset, right? And you know, I just want to say that the, this concept is so deep. I'm really just hitting the tip of the iceberg. If you have more questions, if you want to learn more, please do not hesitate to reach out to me. It's a conversation I'm glad to have with you. It's a training that I'm happy to come teach your team. It's a, a speech and, and, and something that I can come and teach your entire organization. I, I'm just trying to give you a taste because a taste is just enough to get you started down the right pathway of being successful and not letting this mindset hold you back and using it in a way that will only help you move forward, right? That's the goal. And so that's what we're going to talk about today. Let's talk about finding the balance. What does the balance look like? Okay, well, the balance ultimately is this. Continue to think about how you can show up and serve, okay? Not roll up your sleeves and do work, but how you can show up and serve. We've got to change our thought process from doing to adding. That's the first way that you're going to find the balance. I'm not doing work. I'm not earning it by showing up and rolling up my sleeves and physically doing the work, which is what we've been taught a lot of the time, right? That's what earning it means. That's the definition of earning it for the majority of us. And that's how we've defined it and displayed it throughout our lives. I worked hard. I studied hard. I earned the grade. Okay. And it's true. That's part of what that was. But at this phase in your life, you have permission. I'm giving you permission. You give yourself permission to change that definition. Change the definition of earning it when it comes to your career. Change it from doing to adding. Change it from doing work, doing functions, performing tasks to adding value. I'm pausing for a second because I really want that to sink in. It needs to sink in. We, at this point in our lives and our careers, are focused on adding value. When we can show up and add value, which means you know, going above and beyond, that's fine. Adding a little extra. Serving next level. When we're focused on adding value, then what we already know is that we're doing things and we're giving and, and we've earned the paycheck. When we add value, we've earned the paycheck. We've earned the reward. We've done the work. Okay. But the work isn't the doing. It's the adding. That's how you find the balance in this. You change your definition of work. You change your definition of earning it. It doesn't mean that you stop giving. It doesn't mean that you stop working. It doesn't mean that you stop. You continue to give. You continue to serve. You continue to show up. But when you change the definition, you give yourself much more flexibility and you give yourself the ability to succeed not only in the you know entry-level position of a career, but in all aspects of your career, executive and beyond. That is where the power lies in this. That's how you find the balance. Because when you show up and you decide, okay, I'm going to earn, I'm going to earn my bonus. I'm going to earn my pay raise. I'm going to earn whatever it is that you've set out to achieve. That's fine. You can continue to say that. But your definition of earn is not rolling up and doing. It's, okay, now how do I add the most value? Because when we talk about adding value, now I'm not angry that someone didn't do the extra. They didn't give the extra time. They didn't perform the extra tasks. Because that's a measurement, right? We're measuring. We're keeping up with. We're keeping tally. We're keeping score. When I shift the definition to I'm showing up to add value. Well, then the only person that I can measure is me because I define 
how I can add value. And the reason why I know that is because the only way that I can add value is a unique way to me. It's the way in which I serve, live my purpose, and use my gifts. And because I'm the only way that can define that for me, and I know that, I can't define that for anyone else. So how can I keep score? How can I be resentful? How can I be frustrated? I can't. Because there's no measurement that I have in my toolbox to go and measure someone else relative to me. Right? I define value for me. I show up. I provide and add value. Therefore, I generate results. Therefore, I have earned the reward. I've still earned it. Okay. Tracking? Hope you're tracking with me. All right. So that's the first thing is we got to shift that definition a little bit. And then when we do that and we're focused on adding value, we can succeed as executives. We're not going to get rid of our work ethic and, and our focus and our desire to contribute and serve. That's going to stay. We're going to shift from doing to adding, and that's going to eliminate the negative side of this, okay? It's going to eliminate both the negatives. Again, it's going to eliminate the, the measurement, the keeping score against other people, and it's very much going to allow us to be successful as executives because when I'm adding value, that's adding value through conversation, through influence, through communication, through leading people, through creating strategy. I can define value in so many ways. It's it's so much more uh, readily available, right? It's so expansive is what I'm trying to say. The definition of value is so expansive that there's so many things that I can do within this new definition that allows me to grow and perform and succeed and get results in so many new ways that that first definition of earning it gave me. That's how you find the balance. Change the component of your definition. That's my challenge to you. Free yourself. Change your rule. Earning it is still earning it. But I'm not doing, I'm adding. I'm adding value. And because now earning it means I just have to add value, again, that, that is so open to me. I can do that in so many ways and ways that are so unique to me. And it just frees me up to live that purpose and grow my career and go and do all of these amazing things. And I'm still earning it. I hope that you see that. If you've got questions on that, reach out. Let me know. Let's chat through it. Send me an email. My email is always in the details of this podcast episode. So send me an email. Let's talk through it. I'd love to serve you, your team, your organization. Change your definition and keep earning it. It will serve you. As always, go and be legendary.